what started out as a warning ended with gunshots. What made police officers open fire on a man riding a dirt bike in North Philadelphia? According to police, that dirt bike rider had a gun and things quickly escalated. Good evening, everyone. I'm Yuki Washington. I'm Jessica Dean. Our Alexandria Hoff is live at the scene on Whitaker Avenue in North Philadelphia with more tonight. Alex. Well, Yuki, Jessica, what we have learned from police is that this man who was shot and killed by an officer was armed with what appeared to be a semi-automatic weapon and that he displayed that weapon after the officer ordered him not to. But what we have also learned is that there is surveillance footage that captured part of this event and this provided Commissioner Richard Ross with some, with some initial concern over how it was handled. Cries of distress rang out from the intersection of Whitaker and East Hunting Park Avenue. That is where police say around 6.40 p.m. a man was shot and killed by a Philadelphia police officer. It began with an officer who was transporting witnesses to the special victims unit who pulled over to speak with a dirt bike rider who, according to witnesses, was riding dangerously. My understanding is he was just coming over to tell the guy just to knock it off and, and not to drive like that. I don't think he was coming to give him a ticket. I don't think he was coming to try to apprehend him. Police Commissioner Commissioner Richard Ross says that the officer noticed the man had a gun tucked in his waistband and ordered the man not to pull it out. Those witnesses in the back of the officer's car said that the man did so anyway. According to the witness in the back seat, um, that male pulled away from the officer and pulled that gun. Um, at some point, that officer does discharge at least one time right around that location. Uh, it is important to note that inside this business, there is a video of uh, at least part of the encounter. We are looking for other video. Um, candidly speaking, part of that video does show that this male was running away for at least one of those shots. What the footage does not capture is the initial struggle between the officer and the man who has since died after being transported to the hospital. Police say he was shot at least once. We do not yet know that man's identity nor the identity of the officer, but he has been taken off the street as police investigate if proper protocol was followed. But regardless of that, Commissioner Ross calls this loss of life a tragedy. Reporting live in North Philadelphia, Alexandria Hoff, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. All right, Alex, thank you.